It's game day here in sold out San Francisco at Levile Stadium. Both teams look primed to kill each other for our entertainment. <laughs> and I am getting visibly excited just thinking about what's to come. You know what I call your visible excitement, Grim? A San Francisco treat. Bricks, do me a favor. Don't make eye contact with me for the rest of the game. I'm a little uncomfortable now. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Sniffle Thrills take on the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. Hey man, these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. And it's first and ten. And the defense goes for the juggler and rushes to kill the quarterback. If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! <laughs> and it's first and ten. That's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. And that'll bring up second and one. You've got to catch that. And that'll bring up third and one. First down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. They just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. up the first down and it's first and ten if there were any functioning brain cells before that hit they're gone now he's gonna have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit and that'll be second down and four the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Third down in. The punter is warming up. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. It looks like the defense hit the rock. And then he charged the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And then 
Mahomes a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. One, two. And they stack the line, and he gets his bell run for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. First down and one. Hot, hot one, hot two. point attempt. for two points. And he makes the grab and adds two points to their spam. Oh, man, that's the end of his day. He might want to try hurling those traps next time. Man, see that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. his way out of that tackle. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and more than the QB would like. Parts great run and bad defense. 
Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Quarter one comes to an end. If they don't get it together, this game is going to turn into a rout. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got an off. That's a decent punt. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. First and ten. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. And that'll bring up second and one. Nobody can touch you with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third down and, well, good luck. Scrambler. Now well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. What? Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. I'll shoot you in the head. Well, people like it. I'm the greatest. The greatest. I'm the greatest. 
Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon eggs, kimchi. Fermented anything really tastes good. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The court of oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. And the offense averts to Zen. Oh, shit, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. just right so his team can recover it. Holy crap! He runs straight into a mutant trap and dies! Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. And it's first and ten. First down. And we're at the two minute warning, folks. Stay tuned for the halftime show. And it's first and ten. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease foot. If that hit didn't quibble him, it certainly left skid marks. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. First down and five. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed feet, Grim. He's running from his game, it's clear. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. And that is caught for a first down. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first timeout. 
And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Rip, can I kill him? And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run! Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First and eight to go. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Quinn. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. even had a target on that throw. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing in the hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused! <laughs> Third down. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. What? Seem fair. I'm gonna throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Slipped away like a greased pig. He is fighting for every, I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to start as the teams take the field. This game has been one lopsided route. Yeah, football games are kind of like boobs. Big or small, they're both great. Except for when they're lopsided. <laughs> they need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives him five yards there. Second down and five. Okay, no, man, I kill. Come on, man. I have to get on the gap. Get on the gap. Get Third down, and the punter is warming up. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Boring, but...
smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third down, and, well, good luck. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, that guy? Oh. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' his mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves paying. First down. First down and nine. He runs it for three. Second down and six. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. Perfect pass and a score! Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. Second down and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down in a mile. footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Third down and forever. And there's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Come on, ben, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty kicks on the defensive line. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. away from that tackle. And 
And it's first and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. sidelines to come in and punt his knitting is in palm grim that cross stitching unbelievable he's got the ball now and he's going to try and score oh what a brutal hit oh. and it's first and ten for a nine-yard gain. And that'll bring up second and one. He refuses to go down. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again! Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down! First down and nine. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. Third down and long. Just burn the defense pretty hard on that one. That is still edible, though. Just gotta scrape off the charred parts. This one's so easy, they should call it Brett's mom. <laughs> Two jokes are the ones that hurt the most. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Great shoestring tackle. First and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. And this is a first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery.
The offense, look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit five. <laughs> The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Hot two. Right. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and a very lot. One, hot two. One, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. In a hurry up offense, there's no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. And he misses that extra point. Oh, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. And he runs it for four yards. And it's first and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stop all over his opponents. of speed he finds an opening and the first down first down and one whenever a player gets big like this for a month and that's just a great run for a touchdown Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? they just be called sit. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. You've got to catch that. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Hot one, hot two. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch. 
and he turns it on the afterburner. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns. Let's see if he beats the up. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite thing because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the aisle? The defense calls their first time out to save some clock. I save clocks too, Grim. My wife hates them. They take up the whole garage. Wait, what? You're married? Mm, it's complicated. And that'll be a first down. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mono. And the defense uses their second timeout to stop the clock to preserve time for their offense. And it's first and ten. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball. And defense calls its final timeout. Good. That means I gotta deal with that grubby little bathroom attendant again. Always pushing his life savers, dirty cone, hairspray, cheap cologne on me. Hey, I'm here to take a crap. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. And so he does have some turkey skin grafted on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. You mutants out. That's right. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. You gotta be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's gonna be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, man, he just got skewered by those spikes. That was bloody and disgusting. Hey, anyone in the mood for steak kebab? Make mine rare. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Gotta keep them guessing. Six yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in. That famous San Francisco wine you hear so much about, it's coming from the opponent's sideline. The 40 Nightmares crushed their opponents like grapes. Folks, this wasn't even close. It was a total shellacking, like watching a knife cut through butter. Not like an axe through butter, Grim. Or like a chainsaw through baby shit, because that pretty much describes what we just saw. And the MVP of today's game is just about to speak as soon as he gets his jaw back in place. Oh, there he's got it now. Yep. See that little baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Glitchrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every other...